Hey everybody, it is Fetch21530, and I am starting off my second Let's Play, even though Toontown has not been finished yet. Yeah, um... In case you guys couldn't tell, this is Pokemon Emerald. Um, let me tell you something about Toontown real quick. Um, due to certain financial issues in my family, meaning that my subscription ended, for Toontown, I could not do this. Do Toontown anymore. So, um, I love the Pokemon series. This was got me started in, uh, this is not the game that got me started in the whole entire thing, but it's pretty good. I love it. <laughs> so, yeah, I am post-commentating it, and, uh, yeah, I love the Pokemon series, so, um, if I can get started here, anytime, um, so, and, uh, yeah, so, yeah, how you guys been doing? I've been pretty good. Okay, so, push the dang start button. Okay, now, in case you guys haven't noticed, um, if you guys are wondering, yes, I'm playing this on the Visual Boy Advance, which is an emulator on my PC. First, you want to go into your options menu and change the text speed to fast. Yes, 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 I get it. It's no game. Time-based events will no longer occur. Let's go. Who's this guy? I know who he is. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Dude, you're taking it from Oak! This is what we call a Pokemon. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times as friendly playmates and at times cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. Yes, because Pokemon is an epic adventure. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. And in fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. That's for sure. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. No, duh! And you are? What are you, blind? Are you a boy or a girl? Gee, I don't know. Am I confused about my gender here? I think I'm a girl, so let's go with that. Alright, what's your name? My name is gonna be... Everybody, you guys should know my name by now. So I'm gonna go... J... No! I didn't want to do that! No! My name is not J! Alright, let's try this again. J. E. N. N. Y. Jenny! Hey. Yes, it's Jenny! <laughs> ah, okay. So you're her Jenny who's moving to my hometown of Little Root. I get it now! Alright, are you ready? Self! Push the button! Yes, we're ready! Our very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon where dreams of adventure and friendships and wait. I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. Now look at this! What the heck is 
is this? Dude, you start off in the back of a moving truck. What the heck? Why? I, I don't get this. It's a moving truck. Thank you, mother. Why can't I sit in front with you? Um, let's check this. See what this says. The box is printed with a Pokemon logo. It's a Pokemon brand moving and delivery service. You can't check that. What the? Why, why do they have you start out in the back of a moving truck? Whatever, let's just go. Hi, Mom! Jenny, we're, ho we're here, honey! Why couldn't you let me sit in the back of the moving truck with you? It must be tiring riding our with our things in the back of the moving truck. Again, why couldn't I ride with you? In the front! Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? It's our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Jenny! Let's go inside! Something that I never really did until I was like, what, 16? I. Because seriously, up on my new house, I get my own room and everything. I am so happy that I don't have to share a room with my sister anymore. See, Jenny? Isn't it nice in here, too? The Moomer's Pokemon can do all the work of moving us and cleaning up after. This is so convenient! Jenny, your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad bought you a new clock to mark our move here. Don't forget to set it. Oh, jeez. So let's go up to our room and set the clock. Clock is stopped. Better set it and start it. So it is 4.56 p.m. when I recorded this. So let's get to starting it. Wee! Wee! I'm sounding like Chugga Conroy for a minute. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> Is this the correct time? Yeah, that's right. Jenny, how do you like our new room? Our new room? I, I don't know. They finished running. Pokemon movers are so convenient. Yes, I know, Mom. Oh, you should make sure that everything's there on your desk. Let's check out a room a bit. Hey, I want to sleep. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a Nintendo GameCube. A Game Boy Advance is connected to serve as the controller. What? I want that! It's an orange GameCube! Dude! The one in my room is black! What the heck? Dad might like this program. Better get going. That's a map. Jenny flipped open the notebook. Adventure rule number one. Open the menu with start. Adventure rule number two. Record your progress with save. The remaining pages are blank. Thank you, Captain Obvious. As a tradition for until this game, there is in the PC and storage with your item a potion which records which records um, which restores 20 HP on your Pokemon. We don't have a Pokemon yet, but we will soon. Oh, Jenny! Jenny, come quickly! Look, it's the Petalburg Gym! Maybe Dad will be on! We brought you this report in front of the Petalburg Gym. Oh, it's over. I think Dad was on, but we missed him too bad. Oh, yes, one of Dad's his friends lives in, in the, this town. His name... He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Why do I have to? I mean, seriously, I don't want to. Ugh. But we go over here. Oh, hello, and you are? Oh, you're Jenny, our new next door neighbor. Hi! We have a son about the same age as you. Our son was so excited about making a new friend. Our son is upstairs, I think. So, let's go check out this kid's room. 
this guy is gonna purple game you, that was actually a color in the launch. Seriously, what the heck? I got an orange game cube. Why couldn't they make orange game cubes in real life? Seriously, I. There's an email here from the Pokemon Trainer Center. Pokemon may learn up to four moves. A trainer whose expertise is tested on the move sets chosen for Pokemon. Thank you. I'm gonna test this. <gasps> Hi, I mean, this is a nice comfy bed. Woohoo! I'm in someone else's bed. Uh, hi! I didn't mean to end up in your bed. Like, I don't mean to. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Who are you? Uh, someone that you don't know? Oh, you're Jenny, aren't you? You moved in from next door, right? I didn't know that you were a girl. Gee, thanks! What did you think I was? A kangaroo or something? Dad, Professor Birch is the new the next door neighbor. There's and the gym leader. There's a kid. I cannot read today. So my name's Brennan. Hi, hi neighbor. Huh, Jenny, you don't have a Pokemon? Do you want me to go catch you one? Aw, oh, darn, I forgot. I'm supposed to help go help Dad catch the uh, Let's see what this guy's got. And it's the exact same one that we have in our room! Pokemon full restart, and items all packed, and... And what? Whatever. So, let's go up here. Um, hi. There's a scary Pokemon outside. I can make surprise. I don't want to see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. Could you go up and see what's happening for me? I don't have any Pokemon either. What do you expect? H help me! Hello? You over there! Please help! In my bag, there's a Pokeball! Let's go over here. And we get to choose our starter Pokemon. We have the, the grass Pokemon, Trico. Trico is the fastest of the three, so if you want a fast Pokemon, pick it up. Um, I tried it on my first playthrough with Trico. I didn't get that far with it. So, I will not be choosing it. Next is the fire Pokemon, Torchic. It is um, very mediocre. Once you get to its final evolution, it's a fire fighting type, I believe. Um, I may be wrong on this, but I'm not going to be choosing it. I haven't played with Torchic yet, but I'm not going to be choosing it. And we have Mudkip. I love the second and third ab evolution of this thing, so I'm going to choose it. And this, it's a water ground type when it gets to its second and third evolutions. Holy crap, is this thing powerful! I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it! And we're up against a level 2 Zigzagoon, which absolutely sucks. And we have Mudkip! I'm gonna use Tackle here. There's no way I can lose this. Seriously, you have to be really, really sucky at Pokemon in order to lose this. Cause it- DUDE! Look at this! TWO TACKLES is all it took just to do that! Whew! I thought- I was in tall grass studying while Pokemon when I got jumped. Oh, so you're Jenny. This is not the place to chat, so come by my Pokemon lab later. Anyway. So Jenny, I've heard had much about you from your father. I heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. Actually, no, we don't. But, the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off with an amp- a palm, a palm. You ha I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Yeah, that's actually kind of true. My dad knows almost everybody in Central New York, let's just say that. Um, oh yes, and I have to thank you for your Pokemon. So we get the mud kit that we used. Professor Burke. While you're at it, why not get give a nickname to that Mudkip? Actually, we will give it to give a nickname to it in the next episode. 
So next time I will I will see you guys later. We will name our mud kit in the next episode. This has been Fudge Two One Five Three Zero for Let's Play Pokemon Emerald Sun and 